Okay, hi, I, my name's Mark Chambers. I'm one of the full-time lecturers here at the College Belfast Met. Um, I teach in the visual arts programs. There's a few different courses people can pick. Um, there's courses that would cover a A-level kind of standard. There's the extended diploma and 90 credit. And then we do ones that would be students would be applying after A-levels, um, and that would be the foundation. And we now run a HNC in photography. It's basically split into three sections. The first section you will do a diagnostic a testing or basically you look at a lot of experimental stuff. So we have about quite a few different lectures, maybe seven or eight different lectures with different specialisms. They will come in and you'll do a variety of different disciplines and experiment with lots of different, a, different um, materials I suppose. The main aim for it is to kind of show you as much this broad range of kind of a, art and design practice as we can. Uh, it's good for students who have just left school because maybe they may have not have been able to experiment with different techniques uh, and materials, maybe say like in ceramics or even photography or graphics or things. It just depends where, what school they come from. Uh, after that initial stage then the students will focus on a particular area so they'll go into maybe more of a refined kind of specialism it could be like they decide to do painting or illustration or maybe it's product design or different things that they're interested in. The point after that then is a final major project which they will do um, which is basically the exam part of the course so in some ways it's kind of nice the first two-thirds the students experiment and be innovative and they pass those units and then the final part of the course gives them an overall grade so the last eight weeks gives you your merit, merit past merit of distinction, but like uh, what you do at that stage. So students would then generally with us apply for universities and go on. Not always, some students would think about setting up their own business and stuff. The majority of students will go to universities maybe here in, in Ireland or elsewhere and around the world. Um, yeah, so 90 credit a course. Uh, it's just a new course, a digital visual course we started this year. Uh, it's kind of aimed at that one year a course that if students who are maybe again maybe not sure about direction they're kind of thinking about doing a one-year course that allows them to develop more digital skills they can kind of bring into their own work and stuff like that. So that's quite a good course there you do nine units across the, the, the year and it's sort of focused again towards the end. The other course is two-year extended diploma course which again it's kind of almost like a foundation, but it's spread over two years. You'll, you'll get to sample lots of different uh, units and different kind of materials and processes. Uh, a lot of the time, it's sort of evenly split generally between art and design and, uh, oh, sorry, art and design. So you've kind of got like, so a lot of art based stuff, but you've also got some design based projects that you would work on. So it is generally quite a broad course. Um, only other course that's a new course this year is HNC uh, Applied Contemporary Photography. Um, that's over, it's a part-time course, uh, so it allows students maybe post-foundation or post-A-level to kind of maybe think about a more specialised HNC in photography. Um, and it's spread over two days, so it's kind of one of those things that people can pick up if they're working as well. Um, I suppose that's the, the plan for the next wee while is to have other courses maybe that people can pick up like HNCs, um, but those are in the sort of pipeline.